so we're going to be raiding all the festival of trees inside the Grand. Mm -hmm, at the festival of trees. At the festival of trees. <laughs> <laughs> all right, I'm at tree number one, maybe, <laughs> and it's uh, it, it's it's shower themed, I think. And um, out of ten, I would say this is a solid eight. Why would you give it an eight? Why would I give it an eight? Um, because of uh, like extra points for the shower at the top, like there's an actual shower, and it's and it looks wet. So I think they've hit their theme really, really well. And there's a shower curtain behind it, just in case you don't know. You see this? Just in case you don't know, you're in the shower. I'm in the shower. Oh, and there's bath mat on the ground, and I, I'm upping my score. I'm giving this a nine. This is a nine. This is good concept. So it's gonna be hard to beat this. Yeah, it's hard to beat. You shouldn't beat this. You try. I don't think I could, but maybe one of these trees will. <laughs> That's what I meant. <laughs> okay, which tree do you pick? And so there's like a lot of cute little nooks that they have in there. And like you can see a bunch of little hidden ones. So for me, I feel like I want to rate this an eight because I feel like it, the little cubby hole little ones are so, so cute. Um, but I really like a star and it's only now. <laughs> So it loses slight points for that for me. <laughs> <laughs> but it's really cute. It is so cute. What 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 did you rate this one? An eight. An eight. And this little guy. That's so little cute. That's the cutest, right? Yeah. Okay. Where are we going? <laughs> I'm just enjoying the music. Okay, so this tree is is massive. This is, I don't know what, like 15 feet tall, maybe more. Um, this one I'm going to give a seven. Why? Why? A six for how cool it is, because I like the colors, and an extra point for height. But it has all the toys in there. Yeah, okay. I'm dropping its score, because this is just toys stuck in a tree. Okay, yeah, laugh at me. All right, like, I think, I think I could go to Valley Village and buy a bunch of toys and stick them in a tree, and, but I couldn't get one this high, so I'm dropping my overall score to a six for this tree. Ooh. Mm -hmm. And at the very top, it's got, like, the, the tree topper has a topper that makes absolutely no sense. I don't know if you can see it, but it's just a bunch of flowers, like, plastic flowers, sticking out like this at the top so not wanted oh i'd have it in my house for sure and it's better than the one i have but <laughs> but if we're gonna be precious about trees this is a festival of trees so come on get better tree get. here's here's your tree so i'm a big gamer so this tree is kind of fun for me i kind of like a little bit of nerdiness in my tree so I, I just love how it, like, it has really pretty things, but it's also just gamer theme, which I love. So it's a 10 out of 10 for me. Oh, a 10. A 10. Ah, with our subjective rating system, you're winning. Your tree is beating, well, I don't know. This is, this one's paper. Well, maybe I'll give it a nine because it could be constructed better, but the theme is cool. <laughs> yeah. Oh no, the theme is amazing. No, actually, I might bring it to eight because oh, I do I... see some of the things do falling apart. Oh, oh. But. Is this Minecraft? No. No? This is all Mario. All Mario? This is all Mario. Oh, what do I know? That's the coin boxes. <gasps> oh, the ones I would jump on and they'd spit coins at me? Well, you jump under you and you jump under in. Under them? And then sometimes they give you mushrooms and fun things. I feel like I always jumped on them, but that's probably why I don't wincing. <laughs> wincing? Wincing? <laughs> you don't wincing. I don't wincing. Okay, well this is, this is going to haunt my dreams for the rest of is my life. Is it because life. the guy at the top? See if he has those eyes that follow you no matter where you are. Okay, I'm going to go over here. Yep, I'm going to go over here. Oh, thank God, no, he doesn't follow you. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, this haunted tree is full of treats, so that's good. 
And it's got a really nice garland, a really thick garland of balls, which I think is a doable thing for the at-home decorator. <laughs> okay, for Festival of Trees, my score on this. I don't know, it's kind of eye-catching. The, the more I'm... You're, you're giving me a really weird look, like, this is scary. Well, for me, I'm not fond clowns? of clowns. I know. So a lot of people really aren't. For and me, this is low. a lot of him. He's like he's spawned little sub-clowns all the way through. Yeah, I don't know. Um, is your rating five? What? Five. I, I'd say like ten for impact. Take away five for scariness. <laughs> this got a five. <laughs> a that's our lowest yet. <laughs> Look at the face. I would have given it one. <laughs> so this one's cute. Yeah. I don't really like drive trucks or anything, but I really like the stoplight as a, as a star. I feel like that's kind of creative. And I kind of like little details of different cars, but I wouldn't say it's a theme I would go for. No? No. Not as much but as gaming? Not as much as gaming. But I give it credit, it does look pretty, and they do it well. Yeah. So I'm going to give it a solid eight. Oh. Yeah, it's nice. It's just not my kind of tree, but it's a good tree. Huh? It's not my kind of tree, but it's a good tree. Good tree. Good tree. I like this. Ding, ding. <laughs> you want one of those. <laughs> I do. I, I want to I live in one of those. <laughs> Couldn't fit my 15-foot tree in there with my McDonald's garland. Nope. It's right over there. Ooh. Okay. Nah. <laughs> this one has two of my favorite things: travel and doggies. So there's little little doggy. I don't know what this is all about. I really don't. But it looks like. First, I thought it was maybe the SPCA, and it was like. If you take one of these, you know, like when you're at a store and you've got a high-ticket small item, and you take. You, you just take the little token, you take it to the till and they give you the real thing. I thought maybe there's some place where I could pick a dog and go and cash this in for the real dog. <laughs> this isn't a thing. Oh, look at this. Look at that, little suitcase. And up at the top, we've got a plane bursting out of the clouds. And it changes colors. Oh my gosh, this is cool. Okay, I'm giving this one a nine. 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 nine because doggies and trees and things that change color. What have we got at the bottom? A great big Santa plane, which makes a lot more sense than reindeer. <laughs> yes. Mm -hmm. Tequila challenge. box. All right, tell me about it. I think this one's fascinating because <laughs> it's like if you step away from it, it just looks kind of pretty and like nice. Of course the crown's a bit obnoxious, but if you no, look at the details, cool. you get like a tequila bottle, <laughs> which is like, okay. You get some pizza, a golden whisk. It's the pairing challenge. It's the pairing challenge. There's some glasses, <gasps> here's some champagne. I wonder if I could decorate my tree all in like a bunch of weird Just corkscrews that I have. And so at the bottom, there's just glasses oh, with that's like little balls. Super cute. So, yeah. I think because I thought it was normal when I was far away, and then I came, and it just is like, like weird things nested in here. Mm -hmm. And it kind of works with our theme mm -hmm. of our channel. It's a 10 out of 10 for me. 10 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Okay, so this is our winning tree. This is my winning tree. Okay, I'm with you. Yeah, any, any tree where you can just plunk in one of these copper mugs and just set it there and that's that's how it is. I, I, I appreciate that. <laughs> Very cool tree.